Yeah, you know what, guys? I think they must have taken a trip uh, back in time to Santan to take a look at the <laughs> Santan to get an idea. Wait, what's that? Yeah, I know Tess looks weird. What? I, I, we don't dress I the same. I knew this was coming. I knew We're not in coming. your galaxy. I know. She's okay. Look it. She's friendly. I'm okay. Yeah. And my monkey lizard says it's just fine. Good morning, guys. Or as they say, as we've been telling you, it's bright suns here bright on suns. the planet of Batu. And this is the place where I know every, my kids are going to run around this plane saying, I want that, I want that, I want that, because I want this. Oh, I know. It, when they go all out, you've been talking about this all week. You want to dress like them when you yes. see them, when you hear them. Amanda's going to join us and tell us all about it because you can Look really transform place. from head to toe when it comes out here to be part of this. You guys went all out. Oh, absolutely we did. We had some great collaboration with Lucasfilm to do get all that detail into the product to really bring it to life for our guests. So if you want, we can start kind of looking around the marketplace yes. and showing you around. Oh, let's yeah. see let's what's here. Let's start with the clothing. clothes and getting right. the right outfit. So we do have um, our, our Black Spire Outfitters location here where we have tunics such as these, a Ray inspired look, this vest and the armbands, really getting you into that character and living your Star Wars adventure here on Batu. Yeah, Aww. as we know, uh, in Arizona, another galaxy from here, the uh, this is breathable. So if they want to yes. wear it, that'll be nice in every weather. <laughs> Absolutely. And these um, and these belts here, too, they are able to hold your lightsaber. So when you go to nice. Sabi's workshop and build your own hand-built lightsaber, you're able to put it on this belt as well. And you're ready, of course, to fight the First Order. Let's come on this way, where um, this is also a dream for little kids and adults and big kids, because there's tons of cool things. Absolutely. So our Twitter toy maker location this is all where you can find all of these great artisan plush that you see here all the legends of the galaxy um, they have you know been made into these artisan plush uh, so that way you can take them home for yourself I love Chewbacca over here Aww, Chewie. the best That's part of this one. is this marketplace really comes to life because when you walk through this marketplace when you look through here you feel like you're in the movie itself. Absolutely, no, it, it has such a great feel and ambiance in here. Um, we have such great details, uh, but also we have this amazing exotic creature location. Creatures so, from all over the galaxy. All over the galaxy. Here you can find a wide variety of them. Um, some of my favorites we have right now, we've got the Kowakian monkey lizard. So we have him in two different colors, as you can see. We have our Porg, um, one of my favorites. And then of course the Bantha, and one of another one of my favorites, I really can't choose, is the Loth Cat. So we have oh, one that is featured. Cute. We have one featured here. He is sleeping right now, but you can take one home. Oh so, my gosh, he's still moving too. <gasps> <gasps> Amazing. You know what I love about this place? Every little detail, like we've been talking about, it's straight off a movie set, but yeah. even everything with the toys and uh, and all this, it's all controlled. Everything is a little a high tech, a, a step up from what maybe people are used to. Absolutely. The way we were able to bring them to life is really identify their characteristics and bring those out in the features so that way it really does give them that, that life that you seek in them. Yeah, we won't do it too much, but we'll tell you that not only do you have these, you have, you have the uh, lightsabers you can make, mm -hmm. and then tomorrow we're going to feature some droids that you oh, can also put together droid. as well. Yep. The Droid Depot. Amanda, thank you so much for giving us a look at the What's marketplace. That? Wow, I know, here we she's go. okay. Saying something else about She's me. okay. I mean, listen, the smell we could get rid of, but it's all right. I'll fix it. Oh. Okay, you it's okay. It's just a little yeah, Arizona. See, we're going to fight. No, be nice, be nice, be nice. Yeah. <laughs> You're scared. <laughs> so this is the cool thing, guys. You have a little remote, and you get to do this all yourselves. One of the cool things you will find here at the Marketplace at the new Star Wars Galaxy Edge. Again, it opens tomorrow. We are just less than 24 hours away from the land opening and getting to be in Star Wars, right? This is Galaxy's Edge. You are a part of it. You are in it, guys. Uh Good morning. Yes, less than 24 hours away from Star Wars Galaxy's Edge opening this incredible land. I got to tell you, I, I, you could give me ride, you could give me scenery, but what I care about the most, food. <laughs> Oh. Surprise! I, I'm just saying. Okay. So we are with I, the I, right I, guy because no, this, we are. this is John State, and he is the creative director of all of Disneyland, <laughs> of all of Disneyland. That's sort of you're sort of a big deal. Well, I, I'm glad to see that you need me. You need me to nourish you, <laughs> hydrate you, provide some fuel. Exactly. Uh, I, I feel like you're a traveler joining us on Batu. We are, and, and so how hard is it then 
to make sure that if people travel, they are going to like it to begin with? Like, how, how hard was it to create this for everyone to enjoy? Well, it may look unfamiliar, and it may even sound unfamiliar, but it actually has a familiar taste and a familiar aroma. You know, when you're joining us here on Batu and you want to be part of the story, uh, it doesn't uh, stop at just the attraction or meeting these interesting characters. You want to feel like one of the locals eating what the locals eat. Eating, seeing, tasting, and that's what you do when you walk in here. This is Ronto's Roasters yes. that leads into the marketplace. But look, every detail is just amazing. Look at that. They, they, have, they took a pot eraser because pot racing is illegal now. Yeah, you can't, you, so, so they, they So they it. repurposed it. And look yeah, at this. Yeah. Talk about a barbecue or a barbecues when you look at the roaster and then the droid turning the spit right there yeah. i mean that droid i looks want that familiar. job that droid looks familiar yes he's joined us from another place he used to be a smelter ah, you might remember where you saw him last yes. or they were last yes okay okay that's why he looks familiar and now he's here hoping to pilot a uh a vehicle but instead he's roasting yeah <laughs> the best part in true disney fashion uh the best parts when you're walking through is that aroma as you're going through the park. Are we gonna get that here? You will, especially here at Ronto Roaster when we're spit roasting these Rontos and roasting these Nuna turkeys. Oh my gosh, you haven't had a Nuna turkey jerky yet? Oh. What is that? Which one, one is that? This is the That's Nuna this. turkey jerky. Oh, one is sweet, that. one is spicy. Um, but, but the favorite on the savory side, for sure, has been the Ronto wrap, which is that uh, grilled Ronto sausage is what I'm told. Okay. Inside there's a Ronto uh, meat topped with this sweet tangy slaw tucked in this warm flatbread. Um, there's something, that, in fact, I have one for you to try if you'd like. Oh, okay. Okay, just remember, it's, um, this is how the locals like to eat. This is your your well, size version. As Tess is taking a bite, then I can talk to you about this. Do we want to know uh, what a Ronto is or what? Well, a Ronto, I've been told by the travelers, is that it uh, reminds them of pork, uh, okay. quite juicy, quite savory, as a matter of fact. A lot of flavor in there. So That's while, really good. Yeah, while you're enjoying that, I can tell you about another snack. I have my mouth is full. Mm -hmm. Well, here we have Katsaka's Kettle Outpost Mix, sweet and spicy popped kernels. Uh, I've been given this information from travelers. Uh, <laughs> this fuel is known as popcorn, if you'd like to give it a try. It's very colorful. It is, yeah. And again, maybe unfamiliar in the way it looks, but the taste, maybe you can tell me what it's that- It's cosmic. Ah, well, Galactic. Then, yeah. <laughs> All of those things. Okay, yeah. one more thing. We talk about every detail, right? Just amaze that every detail is living Star Wars. Even Coke products. Can we go over here real quick? Okay. Look at this, guys. It's a little <laughs> droid Coke bottle. Whether it's Coke, Diet Coke, Sprite, written with the written language, of course, of what they speak here. What is it? Aramesh? Aramesh. Yeah. Aramesh. Well Aramesh. Said. Well one said. of my favorite things. Yeah. And okay. listen, a lot of people have been waiting for years, 40 years to be exact, to try this blue milk. Come tomorrow, we're gonna save that. We're gonna save that. Come tomorrow, Tess and I try our hands at the famous blue milk. Yes, yeah. we saw What, we what do we have to expect from it? Well, that's from the Bubba Wamba family farms, locally sourced, you know, it's from the Bantha. Uh, <laughs> sweet animal, not happy about being milk, but quite delicious. I'll let you tell me what you think it tastes like. All right. I've yet to hear the same thing twice. Okay, well, I, as long as I don't have to milk it, I'm good. Okay, Once yeah, it's in a cup, I'll, I'll try anything. You know you me. You know what, I'm getting back it. to this wrap, guys. <laughs> okay. Interrupting me during the John, food is I'm thank getting... you so much. So again, good guys, trade. tomorrow morning, the opening of Star Wars Galaxy's Edge right here at Disneyland. Remember, you have to make a reservation just to see the land until June 23rd, and then after that, They'll watch, of course, how many people can come in, but we know it's going to be packed and exciting. We welcome All you. All right. Bright sun. Bright sun. Bright, Bright sun. sun. Bright sun. We'll Bright see you suns. back here tomorrow as we continue our field trip Friday. Two days of fun here in Southern California. He's just going to keep eating. Yeah. Bye. Looks like a, a lot run. of fun.